Let's review how we name polygons. A polygon is a closed figure with at least three straight sides and angles. So let's talk about the very, very first polygon, the one that has three straight sides. And that polygon is known as the triangle. The word tri means three in a lot of other words too, like tricycle. Now, polygons can be broken into two kinds of categories, regular polygons and irregular polygons. So to be a regular polygon, however many sides there are, there must be three, the side lengths must be equal and the angles must be equal. So these sides would all be equal and these angles would all be equal. So after three-sided polygons, we go to the four-sided polygons, which we call our quadrilaterals. And a regular quadrilateral, you guessed it, is what we call a square. The square is the regular form of the quadrilaterals. Now we go from a four-sided polygon to a five-sided polygon, which we call the pentagon. So as you can see, the regular pentagon, it appears that all of the side lengths are exactly the same and the angle measurements are all equal as well. Irregular pentagons are simply just five-sided shapes. After the five-sided polygon is the six-sided polygon called the hexagon. The easy way to remember hexagon is the X. There is a X in the word six and there is an X in the word hexagon. We have the seven-sided polygon called the heptagon. The next polygon, the eight-sided polygon, is the octagon. The easiest way to remember octagon is octopus. An octopus has eight legs. An octagon has eight sides. The nine-sided polygon is called the nonagon. Nonagon kind of sounds like nine, so it kind of helps it make it a little bit easier to remember. And then the last shape we're going to review is the decagon. The decagon is the ten-sided polygon. Now I want to show you this. If you look at this star, you may be thinking, oh look, all of the sides are the same length. Why, isn't, why is the star not a regular polygon? Well, to be regular, remember you have to have 10 equal sides and 10 equal angles, and the star only has five equal angles, which is why the star is a irregular decagon. Now there are many, many more different kinds of polygons. There are 11-sided polygons and 12-sided polygons, but, but these polygons that we just reviewed are the ones that you will most commonly see while you're still in school.